Hi, during this video, I'll be showing you how easy it is to schedule any type of interview from your smart recruiters instance. Um, so the whole idea is um, we utilize the Chrome or Firefox extension to uh, schedule uh, different type of interviews, offering you a lot of flexibility. So for demo purposes, I'm using a uh, test candidate who applied for the account manager's role. Uh, so I'm going to convert him to be in the reviewing stage. So as you can see, I have a template which I'm going to use to create a self-scheduling link. Um, so I'm launching the Chronify extension. Um, as you can see, I can schedule on behalf of myself, someone else or a group. As this is the first screening call and I'll be responsible, I'll be uh, utilizing um, uh, on my uh, booking on myself uh, functionality so I can add some uh, summary uh, notes or any additional event information I can add location um, we integrate with major uh, conferencing service like Google Meet uh, Teams Zoom uh, and many many others I can set up description I can add in tags so I'm going to offer the working hours as you can see, I have a, a preview of my availability. This is based on my calendar. So we require a calendar sync. Um, so I'm going to offer this availability to the candidate, paste it into the email. So this is what the candidate gets to see. So Venetron is our made up company. Uh, and basically I can, uh, I can brand this to my own company logo and colors. The time zone is automatically captured and we translate into 17 different languages. So let's say the candidate right now picks uh, a slot on Monday the 19th. So what it does, it, uh, it's automatically creating the event in my calendar. The candidate gets an invite and my Google Meet link will be added to the event. So right now, if I go to interviews, as you can see, it's already uh, showing up as smart recruiters, which means uh, all of your workflows will just work and you can utilize the extension and just stay within your current tech stack. So let's say right now I'm very satisfied with the interview and we would like to progress to the next stage. So I'm going to set up a, a second interview, which is um, the interview with Marty, our head of sales. So I'm going to use the extension again. And uh, what are we doing now is offering predefined time slots because Marty is always busy, doesn't have time, but I have a common understanding where um, he blocks out time in his calendar to, uh, to be ready for interviews and be available for interviews. So this is where we differentiate from a lot of the existing tools and also the previous use case is you know, the, when people are blocked out of their calendar, the, there will be no available slots. So in this case, um, Marty, his Zoom link will be added to the event. So that's a unique link being generated and I can offer custom times. So what I would like to do, as you can see here, Monday uh, afternoon is blocked out, uh, but let's uh, go into next Monday. So what I want to do is whether Marty is busy or not. Uh, and as you can see here, I can offer those time slots right now. So I can ignore and override certain events in the calendar. We respect Chronify booked meetings. So now I'm going to offer this to the candidate. Uh, I could potentially add additional attendees. So if this is like an ad hoc panel interview, I can add more people. So right now it's the same experience and the candidate picks a time on Wednesday, 21st of December. And Right now, the interview has been booked. So the event is being created in Marty's calendar and the candidate gets an invite. It will not show up in my calendar. So I'm the coordinator or recruiter in this case. I will get a notification via email saying the meeting has been scheduled. So as you can see now, the interview is showing up in the calendar. So I'm, of course, I've been, I'm in the coordinator role, recruiter role, and this will be Marty's interview. So after the interview has been done, he'll receive a feedback a notification uh, and also notifications that interviews are being uh, held at that particular day. So for last, uh, the last use case, I would like to uh, show you the panel interview capabilities. So again, 
sending a template, final interview, uh, which is the panel interview, uh, consisting out of the head of sales and someone from the actual sales team. So I'll be using the pre-setup group. So with Chron within Chronify, you can set up specific groups and group rules where you can even pull from different groups or maybe say, hey, I need to pull from a group of recruiters. So I need two, two out of five or a group of hiring managers where I would need one out of three, one out of five, two out of five, etc. cetera. Uh, I can add some uh, additional information and I can just create a Fantasia link. So what this does in the back end, we, uh, we offer all available time slots based on all different possibilities. So I know this group has three people in there. Um, so it's combining all of the availability and offering those time slots to the candidate. So let's say the 22nd and confirm. So right now the interview is being scheduled. Again, same experience. And when I will go to the interview section, it's displaying, as you can see here, um, I'm the recruiter, I've scheduled the meeting. So Marty is again, head of sales, who's part of the panel. In this case, Adam is also uh, an additional attendee. So we offer a lot of flexibility and offer uh, support for different use cases. Um, that's, that's basically it for the video right now.